Leave me alone, will ya? This is the good part. Hey, it's too bad they don't give scout badges for digging up buried kids. I like to see what that badge would look like. I went over to ask her what it was like, being buried alive and all. But she just stared at me, and twitched, and drew up. <laughs> Guess I got my answer, huh? Good, finally. Hey Steve, you've been doing a swell job putting the paper out in the morning. You just keep doing that and we won't have any problem. See you later, alligator. Hello Steve, care to buy anything today? Just point to whatever you want. I'm a little hard of hearing. Steve, you live close to Mr. Johnson. How is he taking it? Such wanton vandalism. It just breaks my heart. I'll have to send him a nice fruit basket. Though if he wants some new paint and sealant, it'll cost him. Naughty fellows like Deputy Loomis aside, I think every man should cultivate an interest in girly magazines. If it'll keep them out of the field of interior design, those firemen, Betsy. You should hear them carrying on, accusing each other of being thieves. A bolt of cloth disappears. You'd think it was the end of the world. Hello, Steve. Care to... Okay, dear. Come back. Steve, it's so good to see you again. I get so lonely in here. I'm sorry. Want to hear what's happening out in the real world? No. I'd rather forget about Harvest for a while. Come here. Stephanie? I feel so close to you, Steve. Like we're the only two people in Harvest. The only two real people. Do you know what I mean? I need to feel something again. This sense I have that I've known you. It's my only link to my past. Yeah. Maybe it's different than memory. Maybe we don't remember each other so much as we recall the feelings deep inside. Strong feelings. Maybe the body has its own memory. Let's find out. I want you. Make love to me. Then take me. Now.
I'm glad to see you. I f you know the firemen? Someone stole some fabric from them, and they're up in arms about it. Another harmless prank? And how many more harmless pranks will you be pulling? However many it takes to get in, Stephanie. If I have to use them to escape, then I will. Are you using them? Or are they using you? It was just a bolt of cloth. You've turned the firemen against each other. They think one of their own stole it. Would you rather stay here? I've heard that harvest is lovely in the fall when the leaves turn orange and gold and the annual blood drive paints the town red. All right, all right. You have a point. Come back and visit me soon, okay? Did you say hello to your father for me? Thank God for that, at least. Those silly willies down at the fire station are just <laughs> incensed about losing some decorating stuff. <laughs> some people. Yeah. Maybe they should be more concerned with fire and less with flame. cloth. Its loss should trigger quite a bit of dissension amongst our gallant firefighters. Still, that is not your concern. Your next assignment is to break into the tonsorial establishment of Mr. Pastorelli and abscond with his prized barber's pole.
This is your first arrest, Steve. You just remember, we've got a three strikes, you're out rule here in Harvest. But you keep your nose clean, you hear? Yeah. 